I'm Chris, I'm from Poland. Uh, I study in Krakow uh, at Jagiellon University. Uh, apart from computer programming, I like reading books like Witcher books, for example, uh, and watching movies, I think. Um, so I'm Kasia, I'm from Warsaw, I study at the Warsaw University. And apart from studying computer science and doing competitive programming, I also knit and watch TV series. So how did you get to know about Snackdown? Um, actually, last year, some of my friends from university competed because they just knew CodeChef website and they said it's pretty cool competition and we decided to compete. Yeah, and I learned from somebody and this somebody might or might not be Kate. <laughs> I don't really remember, but she thinks that she was the one. So. I was the one. Okay. So you got to know from your university? Yes, my friends, uh, my friends and university were competing and uh, it, we are talking among each other about cool competitions, especially with on-site final, finals and um, the, like the word of the mouth spread and more and more people from my university started competing. Do you think it's important to have a, a culture of computer programming or learning algorithms in universities or in schools so that uh, it helps grow a lot of programmers. For example, we are seeing a lot of participants from Poland. Okay. So, do you think there's something special in the education system that they focus on math algorithms? So, are you asking about uh, education system as it is, or like uh, other participants, meaning like other competitors? Uh, the education system as it is in Poland, and hmm. if if that is the reason why there are so many corporate programmers coming out of Poland. I mean, I do think that Poland has pretty good computer science, and it has uh, quite a few departments are really like focusing on algorithms, uh, and it comes out nicely with uh, competitive programming competitions. Uh, but I also think it's super important to have like a group of people uh, participating in competitions. Like, w you can also do it online, and you can like participate in Code Forces competitions, and you can sort of be part of that group. But I think it's way better if you have like a local group of people, and you're like encouraging yourself, and you're one tries to beat the other and you're getting better both of you. Mm, actually, I'm also actively participating in mm, teaching in high school in Poland, so I kind of know how it looks like. There are maybe 10 major schools all across Poland and they are, there are teachers which are learning programming, which is not a common knowledge in Polish high school. So only these 10 high schools actually have mm, preparation for competitive programming and it's really really hard to start not being in these major areas so I was lucky to be in one of the best high schools in Warsaw so I just started there because I had a group of friends who also did this and I have a very good teacher and I think this is very important because when you have a group of friends, it's just like, an ho like a hobby. Instead of playing soccer, we just like we're doing competitive programming and we're talking about problems and we're like um, comparing each other and trying to beat ourselves. So I think this is very important. Heavy lady composition. <laughs> okay. Um. How do you think Snackdown, or what is your take on Snackdown? What's your favorite thing about this event? Uh, apart from the fact that it has an on-site, finally, obviously, like most competitions don't, and it's, it's great to just come to some, somewhere else and just focus on convening for like a few days. Uh, I don't know, I think it's from like my experience till now, I think it's very well organized. Like comparing to some other competitions like uh, math or like computer science competitions, I think like uh, people from Sagnaus were, were especially attentive and they like picked up us from the airport and did everything for us and like check in and everything. It's not strictly related to like the computer science side, but I think like, yeah, I think there's great potential because it, it seems like you really care. So. Yeah, so we talked about it previously and it's very personalized and we really like it because it's like in this, uh, subject is the best competition we've been to, so this is very nice.
yeah, and nice like accommodation, everything. So, and I hope problems will be nice as well. We we'll see tomorrow. <laughs> so, uh, what would you like to tell people who haven't participated yet on the Snackdown contest, but can do so next time, next year? Mm, the people that have participated in other competitions already. Or? Yes, uh, who are not aware about Snackdown, or maybe people who are even wanting to start off with computer programming. I think. You know, I, I think it's on par with other like competitions. With uh, I mean, from what we can see, uh, it has participants from all around the world. Uh, I think the level is pretty pretty good. If you look at like the top, basically the top people, like the top people in the world, came this year for the finals. Uh, so I think it's on par with other competitions. I think it's worth it. Uh, yeah, you can go to India. You can see another continent that you've probably never been to. I think I don't have. Anything to add? Maybe it, it's it's supposed to be rather than like how to like uh, advise people how to get to Snagnow or like advertise the Snagnow itself. Um, well, advising would also be fine, but uh, like, would you would you say yes, come to Snagnow next year or something like that? Mm, yeah, obviously. Uh, I think it's great opportunity to visit India. I've never been to India before and I'm having great time here and I think that obviously if I would be able to come here next year then I would also come because the contest is has great organization and it's fun just to see another country. Okay, would you like to give our team any best wishes for this uh, contest and the future ones? Your team, as in like cost to culture? Coach, yes. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I wish that you prepared good problems and that we will have fun as much as we've already been having here. I wish that you advised more, uh, that you invited more team for, uh, teams for the. I wish that you invited more teams for the finals so we can meet more people here. Yeah, but keeping the level the same, <laughs> not like decreasing the, the quality. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, thank you. Thank you.